Kohib Matus is over in the Discord. Thank you for being a patron, Kohib. Uh, I assume Kohib is how we shorten your name, I guess, but I don't mean to presume. Thank you for being a patron over there. Uh, is it worth it to upgrade my Eoshin Wizard X220 to a Speedy B F4? So here's the good thing about a wizard. Eventually, you'll upgrade every single part of it because they're going to break and stop working. <laughs> um, I wouldn't rush to do that. Uh, the Ishin Wizard X220, I don't think it's going to be significantly improved by putting a new flight controller on it. So what I would do is I would fly it as it is until the flight controller dies. Now, on the latest revisions of the Wizard X220, the flight controller is actually not the weakest part. The, the Way back when, it used to come with a SP Racing F3 flight controller, and they were famous for just... By the way, it was a it was not a legit SP Racing F3 from Dominic Clifton. It was a, a clone. It was terrible quality, and they would just stop working randomly for no reason, like so many things on a Wizard. The flight controller on the latest Wizards is actually okay. Uh, the main weak part of the Wizard today is the ESCs. And... Uh, I saw just recently on Facebook that the new Ishin Wizard V3 was released. And I said I wouldn't buy it because if history is any guide, the ESCs are going to die. And especially because they're these little slim ESCs that they put on the arms. And slim ESCs are notoriously difficult. Even for very good manufacturers, they're notoriously difficult to make reliable. Uh, and sure enough, I saw a Facebook post. Somebody had the new wizard and the ESC died randomly. So eh. uh, there you go. Um, Raven187 points out that the original wizard, the SP Racing F3 flight controller, did not have any OSD. That's true. If this is actually like a V1 wizard with no OSD, then upgrading the flight controller might be a meaningful uh, improvement because you would get OSD. Um, so I think that what's going to happen is either you're going to have that wizard and you're going to love it and it's going to last you forever. It does happen. Or eventually the ESC will die and then you'll say, oh crap, I got to upgrade the ESCs and maybe a, 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 somewhere along the way you'll upgrade it to a new flight controller. But if it has an OSD, if it already has an F4 flight controller on there, I would put that Speedy B in a different build with better parts all around. That's what I would do. Oh, Kohib says they do have the F3 version. Okay, if it's the original F3 version, yes, upgrade the flight controller, definitely. Because that'll get you an on-screen display, and that is a big advantage. Okay. Man, that's that's been around for a while. 